The National September 11th Memorial Museum has provided a preview of its exhibits ahead of its opening to the public next year. The museum will honor the thousands of people that died in the attacks on the 11th of September and will be America's main facility that will explore the impact of the event and its continuing significance. The memorial will use pieces of twisted steel and concrete to tell the story of how the buildings were destroyed and trace the paths of many of the victims of the attacks as well as the survivors. The artifacts on display at the museum will include the survivor's staircase, the actual staircase that hundreds of people used to escape from the World Trade Center following the attacks in 2001. This was an actual staircase that connected the World Trade Center Plaza down to Vesey Street, where hundreds and hundreds of people used those stairs to escape. Along with the stairs, the museum also contains other enormous artifacts from the destroyed towers, including the steel footings embedded in bedrock. From these column bases that you can see the square on top, that's where the column started that was sheared off in the recovery, but they went up 1,350 feet to the top of the buildings, and this is where they started. The exhibit will also contain large sections of the retaining wall that held back the Hudson River, as well as pieces of steel that were etched with religious symbols by iron workers assisting in the rescue efforts. The museum is not yet complete, but laborers and tradesmen are working to complete the long-awaited tribute to the World Trade Center's victims by next spring.